Hello guys, welcome back to Bioshock. Return to Hall, uh, Hall of Heroes Plaza. So last episode, we were kind of like in a museum where we met Slate, or Slade, whatever his name was, and we got some uh, vigor for electrifying people. And we come out and we get right into a gunfight. So gotta love that. Uh, um, gotta get my bearings down. Remember how to use some controls, that'd be nice. Not sure what's going on here. Uh, okay. <laughs> Uh, thank you, Elizabeth. Thanks. It's been a week, so I need to get all my bearings on what's going on here. Uh, you're, you're running across. Nope, I'll take care of you at some point. I, I wasn't asking for anything more, Elizabeth, but thank you. Uh, maybe I should send up murderous crows here. Let them handle some situations. Are we all set for now? Can I can I do some looting here? Boy, just come out of Hall of Heroes and get right into a gunfight. All right, let's go back up here and then down. So this is where we were last episode with a sniper rifle trying to get up into the Hall of Heroes. Nothing on you. We're full of some salts. Um, where am I going here? Oh, we got to go up on that, huh? All right, let's get going. Should be right behind us because she's got one of those handy dandy little tools. Uh, maybe I didn't want to land there, but I did. Won't that guy die? Um, if I do this, the shield of the tear. Still looking. Booker, catch. I'll let him take all the hits. There's someone over here? Not sure where this goes. Oh, hello. Starting this episode off really good here, just getting right into some battles. Line main entrance. Not really sure where we're supposed to be going right now. Uh, med kits? Do I need some med kits? Yeah. Elizabeth, can you... Done. Thank you. So why would I stop in here? Am I just trying to get on the ship? Is that what we're doing? Uh, I'm not really sure. I think I'm supposed to be going this way. Well, this is the way we came from. Back to where we just came from again. <laughs> Let's see if we're, we can figure out where I need to be going here. See, I landed there. So we don't need to land there. But I'm going to get stopped by this cart. I 
I'm supposed to jump on this one, maybe? I have no idea where we're going. Return to Soldier's Field and power up the gondola. Alright, we can do that. But there's a few people standing in our way, it looks like. Someone's out there with some big weapons for darn sure. Where's this guy? Did he just die? Nope, he didn't die. He dead now. They're all gone. Come on out. Mr. DeWitt, the name's Booker. I'll be certain to attend to that distinction. Booker. And there's a moment when we're not being shot at. If you're interested, I spotted some supplies over there. Not these supplies, but... What supplies are you talking about? Uh, that's Dollar Bill. Don't care about that. We've been in here, though, before. That's right. We never figured out. Um, oh, I didn't see that hanging there before. Got a tip there were contraband guns hidden in the fellow traveler. Didn't find them, but funny thing, we found some old uniforms under the floorboards from the war. <laughs> Took guesses as to why they were there, but <laughs> who's there? You're Slate, right, sir? Put the guns down! <laughs> Did you hear that, Comstock? That is the sound you have never heard. The sound of a soldier's end. Come to your hall of heroes. Prove me a liar. Well, we've already been there, and we haven't figured out what this is yet. I don't know where to find that hidden little treasure of the code. But they just said something about floorboards. They found uniforms underneath the floorboards. Not sure where, but you know what? We'll boogie on out of here, I think. Vengeance is mine, saith the prophet. Okay, who's shooting at you, Elizabeth? Oh, hello. Easy peasy, up and easy. Take all that silver. And up we go. Or down we go. I think I understand how you do what you do. I always thought of them as doors. When I was younger, I didn't just open the ones I found. I remember making them. Making them? I could go wherever I wanted. But I always wanted to come back. To what? I don't know. My family? Huh. How do you do that? Whatever it is. You know how I said I had plenty of time to read? Well, I tried to figure it out. 
I read literature on physics and other such things. Yeah? And what did that teach you? That there's a world of difference between what we see and what is. Something strange about that girl. Um, nothing here that interests me too much. I'm going to save. We only got 2,000 coins here. 2,000 eagles. Uh, we'll save in case something better comes along because I don't really use the rest of this stuff. So let's go ahead and save it. Want to hold on to this? Here you go. Got it. Gotta find my way back to where we were for the gun. Oh, I think it's uh, down around this corner, right over here. Prop the gondola with Shocky Jockey. Uh, what button is that? Is it this one? Bingo. Call the gondola. Easy enough. The gondola's coming. He will abandon you, my sweet Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Once he has what he needs, he will leave you alone. Oh. What else could you expect from a liar and oh. killer of women? Comstock. Father, prophet, whomever you are, I'm leaving, and there's not you can do to stop me. Oh, sweet child. That's where he's wrong. Well, I think uh, we're in for a Watch battle. Out, uh, where? From where? From where? Are they coming from up there? From where? Uh, yep, behind me. Alright, so how do I get up there? Do I want to get... You know what? Heck with it, we're going. Uh. Oh, out of ammo. No, please, we're, we're shocked them, please. Uh, I'm dead. More skills from Elizabeth coming on in. Where are we, though? All right, do I have any more ammo? I do now. Uh, that's not what I wanted. Can I get up there? Yep, and now I want to go... Like this, I think. No, I just wasn't trying to hit that button. Uh, no, I want to get in the other one. All right, so gonna get in this one, I guess. obliged I don't want to open up any tears that she might be able to do because I don't think we need to I need to land not sure where I'm getting shot from up there all right uh, now I see it I do see a sniper rifle. Let's take the shotgun. Have her open up that tear. Now I gotta remember how to aim down the... Oh, there we go.
Oh, I didn't wait enough time for that rocket to come along. Oh, really? I think I missed that one. Finally. He took a lot of sniper rifles. Mercy belongs to the Lord. Where is that? Someone's shooting somewhere. Reap what you sow. Oh, hello. Alright, uh, no. Maybe that wasn't the smartest I've played ever had. No, I didn't want you to come around the corner. Stop reloading. Find something soon. Oh, so that affected him none at all. Here you go. Perfect timing. Alright, so we died for the first time. And finally took care of all that. Any more health around here? Anywhere? Alright, Elizabeth. Let's get on this wonderful little gondola. Can I open that door? Can you open this? Keep a lookout. It's done. No more lockpick, more money. Some help. Alright, we are on the first I think we're on the first uh lady airship, are we not? Conscious on the beach. Kept repeating a woman's name. Anna. I don't want to talk about that. I, I, I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have pried. Where are you from, Mr. DeWitt? New York. What did you do there? Business much like this. Something that really came us right in the present. It was a fine thing you came along when you did. <laughs> How do you think I ended up here? I gambled. And now I owe money to men you don't want to be in debt to. I come here to pay it back. Me busting you out. What do you think that was? charity who sent you somebody who was willing to take my marker in exchange for you sounds like Booker DeWitt has quite a pass all right so I can't go outside not yet anyways Let me out. Oh, thanks. Uh, can I get in here? No, I cannot. Let's check on this side here. There's a carbine. Let's go ahead and pick that up. Lasted a, a second or two, didn't it? Hmm, I'm starting to like this carbine already. If I could hit my target.
So it doesn't seem like we're going to get much rest in between fights now. It's pretty much <laughs> every hundred yards we run into something. seem to take elevators quite a bit lately. So, looks like they call you the false shepherd. And you the lamb. Let's not call each other that. Suits me. How do you figure they'd know you'd be coming? Either they've got a prophet on their side. Har har. Or them that hired me also wrote the signs. Why? Got me. Well, that's the first lady airship. Uh... I think that's Father Comstock. Oh, we'll take the salts first, and all right. Um, salts we seem to be doing fine on shield. Eh, it wouldn't be bad to have more shield. Let's go ahead and get some. Some more health because when my shield nice. runs out, the health will be pretty nice to have. Got a whole bunch of coins there. Can I go through Found here? Some money. Appreciate it. Just in case he's watching us. All right. Leave area. Uh, are we all set to leave? Uh, hang on, let me just double check around here. Sure, why not? I don't see nothing here. You all right? I want to see Paris. I want to see everything. It's up to you now. There's no one. Wait, what is that? Forty North by seventy four West. That's not Paris. That's New York. Did you know that? One thing I had in that tower was time, Mister Dewitt. Time to study things like geography. I owed money. And there's a fellow who, he offered to wipe away my debt in exchange for you. Come on. Come on. Eddie. Everything's gonna be okay. Will you just turn around and talk to me and we can... Yep, that's pretty much how it should have went. <laughs> I mean, what did you expect? Am I going to wake up and she's gone? I noticed the coordinates were different. And she's taken off. Okay. So you're this false shepherd we've been hearing so much about. Caused a mess of trouble at the raffle. You Fitzroy? Nothing but. I got no quarrel with you or your Vox Populi. This is my airship you're hanging me out of, and I got perilous need of it. Really? Because it sure look like old Comstock's airship to Listen, me. I ain't looking for a fight. There's already a fight to win. Only question is, which side you on? Comstock is the god of the white man, the rich man, the pitiless man. But if you believe in common folk, then join the Vox. If you believe in the righteous folk, then join I just the Vox. Want my ship. And the Vox shall give her to you. But first, you must help the Vox. Down in Finkton, there's a gunsmith. 
and supply weapons to our cause. Get our guns from him, and you shall have your ship back. <laughs> So Elizabeth is gone. Find Elizabeth before she lights up. I gotta find some guns as well to get my ship back, apparently. Find the girl, they said. Oh yeah, sounds simple enough. Find the girl. The other thing is, I don't know who is dangerous and. Flying squad came and took him. You ain't gonna see him around no more. Guess you don't mind if I come in here and take some change. Uh, anything new here? Bronco aid, which is something new. Haven't really used that. Devil's kiss, double kiss aid. Uh, okay, nothing there. I don't think. Samuel always thought that the pew on Sunday went hand in hand with the desk on Monday. Science is the slow revelation of God's blueprint. After two years in the Lamb's Tower on Monument Island, he took ill with cancer of the stomach. I prayed to the prophet, and the prophet delivered unto us a miracle through his servant, Fink. I do not know if I will ever get used to a husband bound in a skeleton of metal, but better a handyman than a dead one. Sure about that? Alright, so no one here really cares I'm the false shepherd, apparently. Because I have no idea. Uh, cannot really go this way. You ever get the feeling that they're all just going to turn at once or something? trouble because I'm more than happy to be of service. Um, I guess not. At least not yet anyways. Maybe when I come back through. So the cops really don't care at this point. I mean, me carrying a machine gun around apparently does not affect them at all. I, I, yeah, the cops just don't, don't seem to care at all. They're going to turn at some point, right? They're going to turn and try to beat the living daylights out of me. There's a door here, it says employees only. Edward Teddy Taylor, do, do you mind if I take these clothings? Yeah, let's go ahead and enter. What do we get here? Uh, melee strikes range increased by three times. Um... We'll take the gear. I'm not going to install that. Oh, wait. Uh, apparently, I'm not allowed to take the clothing. So, <laughs> all they did was come in here and take clothing, but I guess, you know, that's a no-no. Oh, hello. Are you the guy that was promised me some trouble? Really? 
I forgot what button is the melee button. That button right there. Found it. You think the carbine at that close range would just eliminate them pretty darn quick? But apparently not. Oh, 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 oh. Where are you coming from? Does it need to go this way? We'll let the machines fight it out out there. May have to deal with them when I go back through. If I come back through. Who are you? Looks like we got ourselves a new vigor to deal with. What does this one do? Not salt. Oh, they're just not vig. They're just. Okay, I thought it was a new vigor we're gonna get. It's salt. So deeper purple just means more salt per intake, I assume. Chase her down, maybe. Where did she go? I just want to talk to you. I said, stay away. There's a tear. Elizabeth, just stay hold up for a minute. Stay I'm not away. angry with you. Yeah, you don't sound angry at all. Hey, watch out! Move it! Move! Just stay back! God damn it! I am not going with you! Don't go in there! I have no need of one such as you! No, no, no! Call it in! Call it in! No! Let me go! We got her! Well... There's gotta be another way. called Slate a monster and a traitor. I know the men who died in all of Heroes with Captain Slate. There is no shame to be counted in their number. The shame lies to we who assembled outside the hall. Though we were not the ones who fell, I feel only envy for those who perished under his banner. All right, so I ran kind of fast just trying to follow her so now I gotta find a way to get to her so I wasn't really paying attention of which ways I could or could not go okay, want me to go this way right here sniper rifle um, are you trying to tell me I'm going to need it Get your hands off of me! 
Oh, I can't jump up to that? She's fine for another minute. Shoot through that? I have no idea. Oh, hello. This is why I love murderous crows because they can do a lot of damage and keep them occupied as you're fighting them. Wait, are you? Uh, that dude is strong. All right, hang on a second. Let's get my shield back. Grab some salt, let the murderous crows do what they do. Where did he go? Should be up there somewhere. Where's this? Out of ammo. Story of my life. Just trying to find the machine that's doing this. Oh wait, where am I? All right, I think that's a problem solved. Can I get anything from that? All right, let's go around and gather up some ammo. I think she's going to still be here, right? Or did she take off? Uh, nope, she took off. <laughs> I did see some salts over here, though. I'm getting a little low on that. Did I not kill someone around here? Switch to this because I don't have much carbine ammo left. Oh, I can grab that through here. Uh, yes, give me some more salt, please. Just what the doctor ordered. All right, so nothing in there. Anything else in that cell room that I can get to or need to?
All right. Uh, which way would you like me to go? Oh, I said this one here. Sniper rifle. Okay, so there's people in here. Can I let them out? Uh, same as before, nothing there, so we'll just get on out of that. So there's no way I can let these people out of the cell. Kind of sucks a little bit. All right, let's continue. Um, I must be missing something here. This just goes around in a circle. Oh, door here? Is that a door? Can I go through? Nope, not a door. Unless I hit F to open. Sometimes the doors open on their own. I am not going to Elizabeth, wait! Ugh. So I was saying, sometimes the doors open on their own, other times you have to open them. I'm trying to jump off there, thank you. I saw the sign that said departure that way, so make sure we get what we can. Did I get that? Yeah, I did. Oh, hello. Um. Just need to supply enough weapons to arm an entire uprising. And where will we get these weapons? From one of our many friends and allies? A gunsmith in Finkton. Should be a walk in the park. What do you say? Partners? You're a liar, Mr. DeWitt. And a thug. But you're also my only means of reaching Paris. I'm not sure why she would trust me to get her back to Paris. Or get her to Paris, but... Comfortable with Lately, my company, Mr. Dwight. You are a means to an end. You are no more. Is. Pay um. Eight hour days. Workers are you okay there, dude? <laughs> Those are anarchist words, my friends. And they he seems alright. It's the friend of hunger, the comrade of want, and the seems right up your alley. Sure thing. Let's see if he gets aggravated by pick locking this over here. Apparently not. Enemies become easier to melee execute. Well, as we know, we'll take the gear. I don't really do melee that often. But, you know, we got something out of it. So you don't care they got a machine gun. All right. Now, Mr. Fink's a good man. You work hard, and I know he'll reward you. Sorry, I'm just taking stuff out of your baggage. Now that I know I can do that, what about this?
Leave the area? All right, we'll leave the area. Yeah, why would Elizabeth trust me at this point after, uh, you know, I told her I was going to bring her to Paris and I went to New York and now she's just like, all right, I'll trust you. Your future is your strengthened. Gunsmith. Who sent you to find this person? Daisy Fitzroy. She's either a great hero or the worst of scoundrels, depending on who's doing the telling. She's good for an airship. I don't care if she's the Queen of Holland. Money for his art. Why, George Washington would only accept the presidency if he were paid a single dollar a year. So, don't let money come between you and your heart. Never say no to lockpicks. I don't have a lot of time for all that prophecy nonsense. I tell you, belief is, is just a commodity. And old Comstock, well, he does produce. But like any tradesman, he's obliged to barter his product for the earthly ores. You see, one does not raise a barn on song alone. Oh, no, sir. Well, that's Fink Timber. A Fink How are we going to get into Fink Timber? Illegally. Let's look for another way in. Lest he soil his own. Elizabeth, a little help. All done. Over there, a service elevator. It should take us down to Finkton. And get ourselves killed in the bargain. You got empty pockets? Let's keep on walking. Um. For the glory of Come on. All right, let's do that. My and I miss? Oh, I don't have no salt. I, you can actually miss, huh? I'll well, we'll pick out the murderous crows. Getting stuck on a chair. Yeah, give it to me quick. Much obliged. I need to kind of find a little hideout spot here just for a second. Oh, I didn't kill him yet. You're not so damn tough. No, not really. Wow, these guys do not. Uh, Carbine does not do much damage to these guys, it seems like. But hey, I didn't die. Found some money. Okay. All right. Now we'll do some investigating. More lock picks.
lot of lockpicks in here. Wanted for known connections to the outlaw Daisy Fitzroy. Looks like our guy's drawn attention. That's not good, is it? No. Oh, what we got here? Oh, just more salts. That was another vigor. Um. Elizabeth. Okay. Saves are kind got of it. uh. Risky because you're using a lot of lock picks, but since we got a lot of them in here, and I only got 34 Silver Eagle for doing that. Yeah, probably not really worth it. Alright, uh, where am I going here? Oh, I gotta hit the button for the elevator on the side over there. Alright. Booker. It's Slate's locker. He must have worked here. Uh, this is my mother's diary. Why would Slate have it? My husband claims the child was created from whole cloth by divine will. I am a believer, but I am not a fool. His bastard shall not be raised under this roof. My mother. She had me locked in that tower. Elizabeth. I just want to get out of this city. Please. What well, we're trying. But as Booker DeWitt, we got a debt to pay, which is bring back the girl to where? Not Paris. Greetings. My name is Jeremiah Fick, and I want to share with you my personal creed. What is the most admirable creature on God's green earth? Why, it's the bee. Have you ever seen a bee on vacation? Have you ever seen a bee take a sick day? Well, my friends, the answer is no. So I say, bee the bee! Be the bee! Um, okay. Be the bee, I guess. Maybe uh. you should get that. Um, uh, hello? Mr. DeWitt? Uh, yes? Hold for Mr. Fink, please. What's going on? DeWitt, Fink here. Listen, my boy, we've had our eye on you, and I can tell you right now that you are our top candidate. Top! <laughs> now, uh, my associate, Mr. Flambeau, will help you with anything you need. <laughs> what the hell was that? I have no idea. He seems oddly pleased to make your acquaintance. Well, the man's got an ego. Most of them do. My guess is that are only good at the company store. Well, he puts all the people to work all the time, looks like. You see, 
The Fink Company store brings you Fink products at a price designed specifically for the Fink worker. Mr. DeWitt, welcome to Finkton. You'll find a variety of supplies here that should see you through your visit. Well, we'll take Mr. that. Want with us. Excuse me, miss, but Mr. Fink's interest is strictly in the gentleman. But why... So sorry, young miss, but any questions regarding the gentleman's application should be taken up with Mr. Fink directly. Does this strike you as good news? Doesn't strike me as good news. We need a coal porter here to haul half ton of coal from Fink Manufacturing to Shantytown. Starting bid. What do you think? Head to the gunsmith or scavenge supplies by the clock shop? Eight. Eight minutes bid. Now eight. Seven and a half. Seven and a half. Six minutes. minutes and fifteen seconds. Six minutes and five. Five minutes fifty. I, I could do five and fifty. Five and fifty. I said five and fifty. Anyone lower than five and fifty? Toll porter goes for the worker in the blue shirt. Let's be clear. I would like nothing. So they're bidding how fast they can do work. Your work day. But the fact is, we need a pipe fitter here. Why not you ask? Well, I can sum it up for you. You see, my friend, the unmanned is the tool of the devil. You take it. Looks like we can enter now. What goes in its place? Uh, so the door opens. Uh, wait, she can go through, but I can't. I like how they just stand there, and at the last second, they're like, "Hey, wait a minute, this guy doesn't belong here." I need to get my bearings. Catch. That'll do. Wait for my shield to regenerate. Thank you. Is that a machine that was up there? Yes, it is. Get behind it. I can't damage it until it turns red, right? Just wait for it. <laughs> and wait for it. It's wearing off. All right. You need this. I tell you what, she is very handy. Wait, 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 wait. I heard another one. Oh, there it is. Luckily, my shield holds up long enough to take them out. A lot to investigate. Where am I supposed to be going? This way, apparently. Here it is, Booker. Chen Lin, gunsmith. Kind of found it by accident, but uh, okay.
And I think uh, this is probably going to be a good time. We'll go ahead and enter so it at least saves the game from this point. Um, we made it to the gunsmith, apparently. And here we are. So we'll go ahead and hopefully get the ammunition and firearms that they require. Go back to the ship. I don't know if I'm going to take her to Paris. I'm going to take her to New York. I have no idea, but I'm pretty sure it's not going to be as easy as it seems. But anyways, that's going to do it for today, guys. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the episode. I do appreciate you watching. As always, I'll catch you again right here in Bioshock Infinite. But until then, have a good one.